You're gonna go all the way up, good, because I'm gonna cut right behind you. That would have sucked if I dropped it right there. Back to my channel. My name is Pete. They call me Scooby. So, how do you think Harley Davidson's going to answer to the Buell? Are they going to are they going to be as competitive as the uh, automobile manufacturers are? Like, for example, the, if you're not into trucks, um, Ram came out with a TRX. It's got this like. 700 and I don't know 20 horsepower beast of a truck four-wheel drive thing is a monster it looks like a pit bull Ford just came out with a Raptor R which is bigger than the Raptor and it's got actually I think believe it a little bit I believe it's a little less horsepower but it's a lot lighter so it beats the Raptor so is Holly Davidson gonna come out with the Pitbull, if you will, motorcycle. Harley Davidson, we need that Pitbull. You cannot let Buell, I'm sure Buell, you'll never catch the horsepower of Buell. It's just the way it is, because these guys are just slow to the game of, you know, with the horsepower numbers and all that. But if you can create a Pitbull style looking, something low, mean, fast, that's pretty competitive with the mule. Do it! They want to see it. <laughs> and introduce it soon. Don't wait for your uh, reveals, because um, we all know how that goes. <laughs> Announce it early, the mule. They're hyping up this bike, man. This thing's going to be insane. Hype it up. Come bring it out early. So I know you guys are going to come out with the uh, Road King ST. You just have to. It makes sense. You know what? There you go. That'll be a pit bull. Put a pit bull bagger. Get the Road King ST with the ST fairing. Right? I'm giving you. I'm helping these guys out. So the Road King will be lighter. Oh, easy there, truck. The Road King would be lighter than your other baggers because it doesn't have that huge fairing in the front. And if you put like the ST fairing, I'm sure it's not going to be as heavy. Those are not as heavy as the other fairings. Keep it bare bones, man. We don't, most of us, I'm not going to say most of us, but a lot of us don't. We don't need an infotainment center. <coughs> Me, I love hearing the bike. I hardly ever turn on the tunes, ever. Not all of us need tunes, we just need more, we need a little bit more horsepower, a little bit more torque, a little bit more excitement, bringing the excitement back into the Harley Davidson, Harley Davidson. We want to see a tire shredding monster of a bike. We need a fire breathing, tire shredding pavement-eating machine, Harley-Davidson. I found neutral again. We need something that when we take off, it's gonna light the tire on fire. Yeah, because we want to burn our tires from like stoplight to stoplight. <laughs> Sorry, Grandpa. <laughs> Did 
This bike, man, oh my gosh, the sound. Listen to that. Mild acceleration. There's no diesel pop neither, man. Bad boys, bad boys, what you gonna do? What you gonna do when they come for you? I don't know, what do these guys think about that Road King ST thing? Carbon fiber, carbon fiber fairing? Yeah! Carbon fiber bags, shed some weight. Get a nice beefy motor in there, and then I'm not talking about an M8. We need an M9. Oh shit. We need like an M9. <laughs> I don't know why. I know it could have been for me because I wasn't doing anything wrong. I got it all on film. Speedometer's off a little. Like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification. Tell Holly Davidson we want the Road King ST. We want the Road King Super ST. Not just an ST. We want the Super ST. We want the King of STs. Anyway, anyway. Like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification for future content. I'll talk to you guys later. Time to put you away. I don't want to. It's time to put you away. I don't want you. I want you to keep riding me. I can't. It's time to put you away. I don't want to. Why are you doing this to me? You're going to leave me alone. Outside in the cold all by myself. Don't worry. We'll, we'll, we'll come back to you again sometime. I don't want to. Don't leave me here. Please. I'm sorry. Stop breaking.